Hello, welcome back to the Basement Card Collector. Today's video is going to be my third vintage sports book report. And I have a pretty good sized collection of books that I've kind of collected through the years of different schools and libraries closing and libraries getting ready for younger grades or older grades, whatever it may be. And I just happened to be in the right spot at the right time. And I scored some really cool books. Um, and I've been doing a little sh series of basically a book report about sports. Um, when I was younger, I loved reading those sport biographies and autobiographies of my favorite athletes. So on my bookshelf, I have tons of things that we've kind of looked at. We looked at a Mickey Mantle and a Bill Russell. This video is going to be about not so much an autobiography or a biographical book. It's going to be more of something that I found that um, actually at a yard sale, but I keep them on my bookshelf. Uh, check this out. Bought this at a yard sale. You can still see the stickers on the top. It's still sealed. It's a Major League Baseball in stamps. And I have three books I'm going to show. This will be a pretty quick video, but check out this thing. It's sealed. Check out the people that have stamps on this book. Roberto Clemente, Cal Ripken Jr., Bob Feller, Alvin Davis, Mark McGuire, George Bell, Dan Quisenberry, and how about this guy in the corner? George Herman Ruth. Looks just awesome down there. And you can see a 30 cent stamp from Grenada. Again, that's just one cool book. I just thought, man, for 50 cents, I can't go wrong with that. I bought this one. The second book it has a different color, but it's it's like the red version you can see. Same set, same year, but check out the people on this. Ernie Banks, love it. The NL logo. Here's Julio Franco, Lefty Grove, Fernando Mania, Jack Morris. Look at Ted Williams. The Daryl Strawberry and Dale Murphy, but I mean, Ted Williams, I think, wins this book um, if you're not a Cubs fan, but Ernie Banks for sure is my favorite uh, so far. And this person at the yard sale had three, three books and three sheets. This is my favorite, and I'll be honest, it was on the top, and I thought for 50 cents sold. I was going to a long time ago. I forget how long I've had these, but I thought they'd be cool to show. Um, Hall of Famer Gary Carter. Look at Big Hank. Hank Aaron. Gaylord Perry as a Mariner. Charlie Huff. There's my man Andre Dawson. Love that. Um, Robin Yao. Kirby Puckett. Ty Cobb. And Don Drysdale. So really cool. Uh, I did get online and look and see if I could even just find these to see what in the world they are. Or even what year. Um, one person said 1990. Uh, some other years kind of varied, but there are two other colored sheets that I don't have. So there was a five, a five page collection in stamps from the MLB in whatever year this was. Um, and so I just thought this would be a pretty cool little video. Um, and again, I ran across them at a yard sale. I thought about uh, tearing them open and sticking the stamps in the book. And then as years have gone by, they just have lived their life on the bookshelf. So that will conclude my vintage sports book report number three. Today's version, just a couple booklets with some stamps. Um, so if you have you seen these before, I don't know. Um, I, I just thought they were cool and I would have bought more of them had they had more than just the three. But um, pretty cool. Three, uh, three stamp books in the book reports on my bookshelf so that will conclude this video thank you for watching and we will see you next time